Look up. Rare atmospheric light show dances high above BC. We know BC is beautiful, but it's good to be reminded of just how breathtaking it can be as we prepare for a turnaround weather-wise this fall, and nothing reminds us more than a stunning light show of Aurora Borealis, aka the Northern Lights. Among those taking advantage of the perfect stargazing conditions to check out the geomagnetic activity is a BC man who not only got to experience an incredible sight but was kind enough to share his breathtaking photos with those of us who missed the show. Capturing these stunning shots wasn't easy, but professional photographer Greg really said he monitors the sky for aurora and sun flare activity through apps, which send him alerts for potentially great viewing opportunities. I use the app Space Weather Live in my aurora forecast for alerts on aurora and sun flare activity. While many in southern Canada were treated to a rare northern light show earlier this summer, many discovered later that their photos weren't exactly pristine, according to Really, he uses a few techniques to get the best takes. Often, the camera can capture light particles that the eye can't see. I do test photos from my patio, and if I pick up enough aurora activity, I drive to a location like this one off Highway 97 where Osius meets Oliver and find the compositions I like to capture, he said, these exposures are 3 to 20 seconds each and high ISO using a wide-angle 14mm lens, he said, meaning your steady hands will likely not be your best tool here and getting a tripod might be a better bet however, a longer series can also capture incredible beauty, which really explained is what he used for the above image. The Star Trail photo was a stack of 188 images from the time-lapse series, he said about his photos, which he took over two nights at the end of August, slow and steady wins the race? Well, at least for Skywatchers, patience sure pays off. If you missed the latest opportunity, there might be more ahead for a little while. According to Forbes magazine, it's been a particularly exciting time for Aurora Chasers, once rare displays of northern lights at southerly latitudes look set to continue for the foreseeable future as scientists confirmed that August saw the sun at its most active for 23 years, reporter Jamie Carter wrote, scientists explain why the sun is so important for seeing those beautiful greens and purple hues. Energized particles from the sun collide with the Earth's atmosphere, and the magnetic field redirects the particles. They become the chemicals that turn into those incredible colors that might mean incredible viewing opportunities for the next two years, which is great news because we need some time to hone our camera skills by then.